Good morning. What is your name? My name is Vishal Rana. Vishal, we are going to have uh, the recording of our practice session. So, are you comfortable? Yes, I am comfortable. Would you have to speak with the volume so that our voice should go clearly in the cam? Right? So, we are going to start with some uh, startup questions. I want to know where do you live? I live in a small town. It is a Taliban. It is the name of Taliban and it is located in the northern part of the country. Okay. Do you like uh, the area you live in? Yes, definitely. I do like the area where I live. It is a very beautiful city where I live. Okay. And, yeah, also, uh, it is. Uh, One more reason you love the place. Uh, another reason is the city is full of many facilities like transportation and uh, academic institution and etc. Uh, have you seen some changes uh, over there growing as a child? Uh, I guess back then uh, there wasn't uh, enough uh, facilities available in my hometown but these days there are plethora of facilities that are constructed First of all, uh, in past, the road was not uh, well, well constructed and other thing is that uh, there wasn't uh, even a uh, high school but on this day uh, the roads are very well constructed and even then the academic institutes are well uh, You are well having good academic institutions over there how would you compare your town with other cities? Uh, you can say that uh, my town is neat and clean, it is pollution free, but if I talk about other cities, we know that pollution is a big problem, the environment remains quite murky. If I talk about employment opportunities, that are not very big in my town, in my place where I live, whereas in big cities, uh, I believe that people get great job opportunities too. Comparison can go like this. Do you think that uh, more and more people are today migrating to cities? Yes, definitely. Due to lack of education system, most of the people from small villages are migrating to big cities to uh, assist some uh, education, good education service. For education purpose, For education you believe purpose. that uh, the youth is migrating to the cities. Is it a positive change? Uh, I would say in some ways it is definitely a positive change okay. because if a person isn't getting a valuable education, then it is very necessary for a, uh, a person that he should go, he should to, go to big cities to, to get some valuable education. For career, you believe it is good and it is good for the youth and otherwise. Okay, you are preparing for IELTS. Do you know what IELTS stands for? Yes, definitely. First of all, I guess, uh, the IELTS stands for English. Uh, International English Learning Testing System. English Language English Testing English System. Testing System. It is a uh, basically it is an English test that a person required to uh, to achieve to achieve uh, higher education in other uh, con in other countries in uh, right. So, are you good at English? Uh, I guess I am quite average in English, but I. Uh, speak very well English and, and I can easily communicate with uh, foreign peoples. Where do you study English? Where did you study English? Um, I have been uh, studying this subject I since my schooling. Since my childhood in my mm -hmm. school. But now these days I am uh, getting some English, English classes in uh, Spoken Institute, English Spoken Institute. Nice, <laughs> Spoken English Institute. What was difficult for you uh, in English language as a learner? As a learner, I 
faces so many ups and downs. First of all, uh, when I was learning English, uh, when I was uh, learning English, uh, no, you are talking about the things in past. When I was learning English, I faced so many ups and downs. Like I faced many difficulties. I faced many difficulties. Like I had to study for a lot. I had to work on the grammar and, and the radicals. I had to work on the grammar and pronunciation. That how to pronounce the proper word and also the vocabulary is very uh, vocabulary is and it took me in a until now. <laughs> okay, you think that you were not having good words in your pocket to speak and you worked on pronunciation, vocab and importantly on grammar section. Right, it is Vishal, things are good, we need uh, more practice to achieve our target and the things will continue. Thank you, thank you so much.